All the equipment for a local soccer club goes up in flames, destroyed in, a, in an explosion. Yeah, the Sardinia soccer building is a charred shell of what it used to be. Angela Ingram explains how the community is trying to pull together to help the children. This year, more than 150 children are playing on the soccer field, ages 4 to 14. But yesterday, the Sardinia Say soccer building blew up and they lost everything. This is a picture that one of the parents took. I had a little girl with me. I was mowing before it all happened and she didn't want to let me go. She just kept hugging me. I couldn't believe it. I said, blow, blew up? How? I mean, the nonprofit did not have insurance. With soccer being one of the only outlets for kids in the area, the mayor put together a GoFundMe. My daughter played on this field um, and I am all about the kids in our community. I mean, that's what I'm about. I want them safe. I want them to have things to do. And this is the aftermath, the charred remains of the building that housed equipment and other items. There, there was also propane tanks, obviously, for grilling hot dogs and hamburgers. Uh, there was paint cans to paint the lines. There's been no official ruling on what caused it. The assistant fire chief says it appears to be an accident. He's also a member of a nonprofit called the Sardinia Fire Department Incorporated, which is looking at using donations to help rebuild. They're all just grateful it wasn't worse. We were very fortunate with people being in the area. It could have just as easily been one of the chi children inside the building. Uh, had that happened, uh, we would be talking a different story today. You know, it's life for them. Uh, this is time, in such an uncertain time of this quarantine, this is going to be their only time to get outside and to play. In Sardinia, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. The assistant fire chief says there is a meeting tonight to talk about helping to replace that building, and that money would come from donations through a nonprofit.